Hello Gun Nation! Big Johnson coming at you. Hey, just wanted to share something with you. This is my A-Rex, Rex-01. And I'm loving the pistol, but as y'all all know, maybe from my past videos, I did not like these grips. So I had some on order from KVAR. It's K-V-A-R Corp. They're out of Las Vegas. They were on intergalactic back order. However, Jeff is the man there at KVAR, and he called me and said, hey, your grips are in. So they actually shipped them to me. So I kind of wanted you to show you a before and after. So here's the before. If you can see it there very well. You know, just your standard plastic grips. And here is the after. Those are the FDE G10. Now these are made by Hogue, but they are exclusively made for, K for KVAR. So can't get them anywhere else. But man, I got the FDE. They make them in FDE, green, and then they make them in the black. But it is the G10. So we'll go ahead and change this other side real quick. Super easy. These are uh, Torx, and it is a Torx 10. So we'll pop these out real fast. The screws are definitely a different type of screw. I'll hold one up here in just a second to show you. But it is a Torx 10 if anybody needs the exact size. But these are the screws. They are super, super tiny. I don't know how well you can see that. And there's the head. But we'll put those here and we will remove this grip. Just get a little cloth. You know, wipe any kind of oil or any residue off, anything that's up under there, any dust, you know, anything like that before you put the new ones on. And I want to show you what the old one looks like. So here's the old one, you know, just your basic plastic, nothing special. And we'll get that one out of the way. Here's your new one. If you want to up close and then it says rec01 htm and on the other one it says hogue but that is what they look like so we'll go ahead and put those on and I'm sure y'all have all put grips on before maybe you haven't you know you just want to loosely tighten them then center everything Make sure it's good, your controls are clear and all that good stuff. And you don't have to crank it down. But there she is. So we're gonna function test it, make sure the safety works. Not that I use that. Make sure the slide works. And it does. And the decocker. But man, I really think it makes this gun pop really well. So, and I've got my TLR1 HL on there and this is the Flat Dark Earth Dark. They have the tan one and the goldish looking one. This is the dark one. I like this one the best. I, it doesn't bother me that it's not a perfect match, but if you look, there's a little bit darker here and it picks it up there. So, and as y'all all know, maybe from some of my other videos, I definitely like to be different. I don't want to be like everyone else. But just wanted to share this with you, but Jeff, man, he was a great, great guy. I mean, he was on top of it. He actually called me. I had called a time or two just during all this to check, but I mean, he called me the second they came in and had a set with my name on them on hold for me. But I think they look really nice. They actually feel a lot better and they're not real aggressive like some G10s, but actually has a little bit slimmer profile, just a little bit. It's got a really nice notch cut out there for your thumb, you know, so you can, and I'll test this. I'll put a, this is empty and this is a clear pistol. But, yeah, I can actually get to the uh, 
get to the mag release pretty pretty easily now. Before it was a little hard because it's a little fatter there. It's got a really nice shelf there, but yeah, it's this is definitely a winner. But just wanted to share this with you guys and ladies. But KVAR has the grips in stock. You might have to get on a list because they're probably going to go quick. And the solid black, the green, and then these are the FDE. So as always, an unarmed nation is a very weak nation, so we got to carry on.